Hello everybody and welcome back to uh, another episode of Surviving Mars. Now, a quick recap from the last one. We have built another dome. We have quite a quite a boost in in, in our um, uh, numbers for the for the colonists as as well and we are getting some research done too so uh, uh, coming back to the colonist point that that is why we are starting to build up some more domes um, just uh, slowly but surely start expanding we're we're thinking of getting the research lab up fairly soon as well but the uh, more pressing matter right now is our uh, electricity uh, well the the production we are Ah, oh, this still discharging. Yeah, um, I think we're gonna run out of power. But as soon as the daytime comes, we will have a bit more power. Yeah, but we'll have to sort this out. So we'll we'll come up with uh, with something in in this episode. Uh, let's have a quick look at the research as well. So um, uh, right, so nuclear f uh, fusion is the uh, next research that will be done very, very soon. We also have the eternal fusion, which means once we build one of those nuclear fusion plants, uh, I'm, I'm hoping that the upgrade isn't going to be too expensive, so we don't have to put any people in there to keep them online. And uh, therefore, I think this will, at least uh, for the time being, for the next few, I don't know, like six, seven episodes, this should solve our uh, problem... Pro uh, our problem with the with the power. There we go. Uh, we've also relocated our landing pad just a little bit out, uh, further out from here, so that way we can start putting some passages in here and also uh, hook it up to the um, uh, the water. Yeah, that's the plan. Now we've got two rockets waiting. One is with the payload. The other one is nothing. So the nothing can go. Oh, I wanted to put it in the middle. Oh well. And uh, let's see. Uh, okay, okay. Hmm. How long can they survive? They're already taking sanity hits. Oh, and this storm is off, isn't it? Oh no. Well, it's almost, almost daytime. I think we can sort of see the sun. I really hope it's rising very soon. Uh, yeah, so maybe we'll just close our eyes, speed up the time, and uh, hope the sun comes back out. I oh, know. There we go. Come on, solar panels. Come online. Okay, I think power is. Yes. Power is back. How much are we charging? 50. Oh, that's still not enough. How are we consuming so much power? Oh, we've got another problem over here. All those people that are working, but we don't have a rare metal storage here. So, oh, here it is. Let's um, put one down. Maybe here. Okay, and... Um, yeah, and the drones are already moving in. Okay, so that's good. Now, uh, let's pause this for one more second. We, we will... Uh, how are we going to do this? Nuclear fusion is almost done. Uh, we want to expand this way, so maybe... Maybe the power line is gonna come somewhere here. And maybe... Maybe we'll put the... Uh, the ta uh, accumulators in here, which means we'll have to uh, move the landing pad again, but... Uh, yeah, I don't want to expand uh, this way right now because I want to reserve this space uh, place um, for the dome. I'm not sure where it's gonna go, but I'm thinking like a bigger one somewhere here. But I just don't know where the um, uh, what is it the uh, passages are gonna go exactly. So, so yeah, I'm gonna hold off that expansion there. Maybe we'll do it this side. And we'll get a accumulator running in this this location here. So um, um, let's see, let's see. That means we are gonna need to bring over the passage here as well. So let's see what's in our way. Okay, we need to get rid of that solar panel and also those pipes, which I think should be okay because the pipe we can reconnect after the passage is built. 
and the solar panel well it will just have to have to go i guess uh, then we have power here and then i think it should be able to feed power through here as well yeah that might be fine so cool let's let's do that i'm a little bit scared to <laughs> destroy any of those um, solar panels right now but uh, it's a uh, it's a must so then we can Oh, let's uh, let's change this straight away. Uh, let's um, let's see let's see this again. So accumulators. If we put the accumulators here, okay. So uh, one gap in here. I might want to put the nuclear fusion plants. Maybe we can do them here. I can't remember if they have to be in range, but we're very close to having it researched. So, we can wait a second. Yeah, just, um, what is it, five more percent over here. Wait, have we lost one of the, the genius colonists? Has he, like, died or something? Oh, man. And for a second, I, I don't want any more babies right now. I can't, I can't cope with that influx of, uh newborns i need to get this this sorted over here no i didn't want to turn it off i wanted to uh maybe we'll do it at night time let's see how much juice can we have in this battery uh i don't know if that's gonna last the night uh what's consuming power maybe we'll turn off this at night because that's consuming 15 yeah let's let's turn it off at night time uh, let's let's do this. So that means at night time we'll, we'll consume a little bit less, and maybe it gets gets us through the night. I I do not know. Let's see, production demand. Hmm. Is there a gap on those? How much they can charge? Like, it doesn't say here. No, there shouldn't be, right? Because this doesn't seem to be 50 here. We're producing 217 minus 50. That should be like... Well, we should be charging a lot more than, than 50 is what I'm trying to say here. Okay, 99%. Let's see. Discharge 32. Okay. We'll just have to pray it's, uh, it's going to take us through the, through the night over here. And... Uh, almost done on this research as well. Let's speed it up so we can uh, we can have it a little bit quicker. Hundred percent. So come on. Research Look. complete. Here we go. Nuclear fusion is done. So let's see how big. Oh wow. Okay, so we can build them outside. That is good. However, let's pause this for a second. We can. Not pause. Let's uh, let's put it on the slower speed. We can rip this one out. So how do we wanna place uh, place it? Yeah, maybe something like this then. Right next to the the scrubber. Maybe it can go like this over here. And one more thing I wanted to check. Does it say... No, it doesn't say here what the upgrade costs. Okay. So that is out now. I think it was this pipe. So let's try and bring this passage through. Maybe we'll have to start from this end. Oh no, there was those pipes in here. Well, let's see... What happens if we do it this way? Is that wire still in the way? It is. Okay, can we, like... Where's the uh, power... Uh, salvage. Here we go. Okay, let's do that. Let's place this down over here. Oh, another thing I've just realized. That means we are going to be blocking... The drones, though, they will have to go around. But I think 
Uh, maybe we'll figure out some sort of a fix over here so the pipes would... Um, maybe we can put the passage over here. Let's see. Oh, wait. I don't think we'll need the power cables here since everything should be connected anyways, right? At least I think. So um, what we can do is let's go to life support, uh, take those pipes and bring it over like so. So that's connected again. That's looking good. Um, where's... What do you mean? It's connected. Or, I don't know, maybe there's something that's disconnected over here. Not really sure on this, but... Um, okay, so next thing. Let's bring down those resources now. Uh, where should we place this? Maybe like like here. And I'm hoping it's still in the range, so... Where is our... It is. Let's speed this one uh, up. And now I think with the accumulators... Now it depends where we want this ramp. Do we want it here? Do we want it here? Let's see, let's see. Oh, here we... we mm, yeah. Well, I think for the time being, let's just... Uh, I guess we'll just leave it, uh, leave it be, and, um, come on, power, accumulator, we'll have accumulator over here. Yeah, that should work. And then we'll also, also turn on this one here, but let's have these things built first. Now let's speed up the time. I think we've got a somewhat of a plan now. And we might even invest in a additional MDS here. I'm not sure if that's a bit of an overkill or not. But if we could find them. One is over here and the other one was oh, right over there. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. Well, uh, we don't have to put another MDS here for the time being. So can we please have them built? Oh, I know why they're not building anything. We need concrete delivered. Okay. Right, so we have some uh, people that don't have jobs. So for the time being, let's let's just put them here. And let's see, our power production is still... Yeah, it's still 50. Okay, so there must be some sort of a cap on it then. How much you can, uh, you know charge per per hour i guess which is odd i mean it sh should be yeah it should be different but it seems like it's being capped at 50. Uh, that's all right we'll just have some more accumulators Sector here scanned. and there and we should be able to survive this night as well okay very very good indeed uh maybe maybe this isn't gonna be a too big an is issue for the time being i mean the ramp over here not having the ramp because they can go through this dome it's not too bad although this one here yeah it's a uh, would have been nicer if uh, this exit was uh, over here I think but oh well we didn't know about this when we first built this dome so um, all is good we'll, we'll figure it out we will have a solution for this some kind of a solution okay so ramp is almost done let's see they're already bringing resources for these things as well let's turn on the scrubber too another story bit let's see the door to summer uh, do you want to live forever apparently the clients of eternal summer are large uh, cryonics company intend to do so Fearing that Earth could be destroyed by a cataclysm, the 10 richest customers of Eternal Summer have paid for a rocket to host their cryopods. It has launched towards Mars where they are relying on your colony to, to resupply the cosmic arc. 
effect the eternal summer rocket will regularly ask for permission to land if you resub resupply it you will receive immediately 150 million upon its launch um let's see Ooh. and now it wouldn't be too bad to be the russians it will cost them the extra let's say triple yikes wow so uh 450 instead of 150 uh <laughs> i i was i was thinking it anyways like one of the maybe in the future if i'll do another playthrough even though the oligarch didn't seem like the most interesting one to me i, I mean maybe we'll figure out a way how to you know take full advantage of that but i think for the for the time being sure i mean i don't know what they ask uh, what they're gonna want us to resupply them with if it's just fuel then we've got plenty of fuel but if it's like food and other stuff as well let's say i don't know some kind of metals maybe they'll need that for for some reason no idea why but I guess we'll, uh, we'll, I guess we'll live and see. Okay, come on, guys, can we please have those things built? Are anomaly we like found. out of polymers now? We got a few left in here. Another anomaly. Okay, good. What are we researching now? Okay, the GHG factory. Then we got a couple of quicker ones. So I think we've got to decide now what do we want to research next. I think that was. The electronics factory. Yeah. All right. Almost there. Where are they going? Okay, I think to speed this up, maybe, uh, maybe we'll put um, we'll put you over there. Resources are low. Are they? Let's see. This is bring, gonna bring us uh, almost 50. And these apples, not quite at the 80 mark yet, but it should reach that. Oh, yeah, the soil quality is Research only 60% here, so that's okay. So we have the GHG uh, factory now, which is great. Uh, let's, let's see. And. Would be perfect to slot him right in here. Or maybe one even, even like, oh, I'm just clicking too many buttons, like, like so. Uh, let's pause this for the time being. I'm um, still a little cautious about the, uh, what is it, the ma machine parts. Although we will land this rocket here. Are you serious? It's gonna take electronics and machine parts. Ah, oh. there's no way we can do that. No way. And it's only 150 million. It costs us way more than, more than that to. Uh... Yeah, that that's not happening. It, it's gonna be annoying when it's blinking over here. But oh well. I just hope we don't actually think, um, miss miss, uh, you know, forget about it and accidentally land him here. Because, yeah, that would, uh, that would not be cool at all. Uh, so what's going on? Are, are these being built? Come on. Hurry this up, please. And where's the uh, rover? Uh, he's gone a little crazy. How did you... Okay. Just go over there. All right. Nice, so the accumulator is up, Sector and this scan. one's actually fully charged now as well, so that's good. I think our power is looking is looking better, so that's good. I think we can unpause this here, and hold up. Before you unload all those electronics, how about... Let's see, it was this one. Okay, so maybe they don't have to unload all those... What is it? Electronics, yeah. So they're gonna stay in here and we're just gonna have to load up the 
fuel, so that's gonna be 160 fuel in total, and then the medals as well. Are you in the range of the medals? I do think so, but we'll just move you a little bit closer with this scrubber. I don't think we need to extend this one too much for the time being, because those two are already scrubbing each other, so that is okay. And that's going to a special project. Okay, yeah, yeah, this is that one here. Cool, okay, so that's gonna take some time to load up this rocket here. And we have unpaused the uh, construction on the research lab, since we have some people that could uh, start working. And then what else? We've got to figure out our population really wants to expand. Uh, yeah, we got 30. Okay, this is going to be, pro be a pro problem. We've got 36 adults and uh, no kids. There's only like nine that are growing up right now. So, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, let's build uh, this kiddo dome here. Well, sorry, that's already built. So I think this is going to be the for the kids. And what we'll do is... Where are they? We are going to build a school here. Research complete. Well, somewhere here. Let's see. Transport optimization. Okay. More and faster, which is good. Um, how far are we from the... Okay, so that's going to be queued up soon as well. Since we have two more things. Let's see. What is something we? I think we want? Uh, well, that's going to be a quick one. We can do, do that. I think we wanted to get the bigger dome as well, but we don't need to research this. We can skip the low ng low G engineering and maybe go for the bigger one. Oh, oxygen is yes. Maybe almost forgot about that. Maybe we should start improving that as well before we run into problems. And then we'll look at uh, some of these things in here. Maybe start making some lakes or maybe there's some other more important um, ones that we should focus on. So let's try and maybe one over here. Uh, playground. Let's do one here and another nursery. I don't know. Something like this. And then uh, filter by age group. We will want the kids to be here. Maybe the youth as well. But we're going to turn off everything else. So that means we are going to have only kids in here. Well, once we once we turn it on, of course, the two people are homeless. Um, should we put a temporary house here or no? I think once we put the kids, we might be in a better spot. I think the next project will be. Maybe we are blocking our way. I I I don't know. Uh, let's see. We wanted to put the bigger dome once we research it over here to get the two vistas and maybe even two research sites as well. So maybe this one could be like a research dome. Uh, and then we need to um, plan out like the farming dome as well. And now that I think about it, maybe it would have been nice to connect them up. So let's say we put the farming dome here and then we could connect it up. Uh, those both both of these tomes, but that means we're gonna have to move everything. Well, maybe not Maybe those passages can kind of like go around Yeah, okay. We'll just be careful how far we how much and how far we expand here uh, Cool, so these things are slowly being built uh, I think our Power let's see production demand Okay, I think that's okay for for a second, we only have 46 electronics left now. Maybe you can put some more population in here, actually. Because, uh, I mean, yes, we are going to have a school. Uh, where should we place this? Maybe here is safe. So we don't have to move it around so many times. And then... I don't know. Let's see. Um, maybe we'll bring a... Build another passage over here. Let's see. Like, Sector scanned. Anomaly found. 
So we build it here. Just a quick second. Is this the best placement? Or... Let's see if it goes straight in here. That might be better. Because then... We could have another passage come from here. And go out. Yeah, I'm thinking this might be the most optimal solution. At least for the time being. And then we can hopefully still, bu uh, still build one of the like uh, ramps over here as well. Well, let's see how it goes. Uh, let's see, another anomaly. And it's a breakthrough. Go and scan it, please. And then, let's see, we still have one, two, three research ones over there. Okay, so that's good. And then once you're done, uh, come home. Let's see, then machine parts. Okay, I think, yeah, let's, let's build it. Let's build this one here. I think we, yeah, we should be fine with the power needs and the scrubber is covering this as well. So we can slowly, slowly but surely start building up the atmosphere. Cool, what are you up to? You are full. So how about you just unload this here? And then since there's no storms right now, um, I think don't want to manage you right now I've got bigger problems at hand so let's turn on the automatic mode and and yeah he's just gonna go off and um, bring all the all the resources to us which is uh, very very nice of him uh, okay so the passage is almost built as soon as it is we will slap down research complete uh, is it gonna matter where we where we place this? I do not know. Maybe we'll just put it right in the middle. Wait, 3D machining is done as well, so we can do the machine parts factory. Uh, which is cool. And okay, we are... Okay, let's see. What else? I think we'll soon go into... Uh, <laughs> Martian born... Oh, that would be nice, actually. Let's let's put the yeah a little performance boost in the in the queue there as well. Now, next important thing we can have yeah, let's have more people work here. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, oh, no. Ah, oh, I'm so silly. I should have placed it here. Let's see. Mm, okay, I don't want to waste the machine parts. Uh, but I was thinking of maybe putting another uh, residence building here. Let's see. Okay, so we have... Hmm. Four people are homeless. How many seniors do we have? Oh. Okay, maybe we do have to... Build a dome that's um, the holiday home. Okay, let me just slow down time. I uh, don't want to rush into anything that I might might cause uh, bigger problems later. Let's see. So if this was the uh, our pa, 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 what was the word our farm dome could have it here like so. Could get create some more space here and allow another connection. How much space do we want to leave in between? Maybe something more like, more like. Uh, let's see. So, I think this should still. Or no, I think somewhere here might be most optimal. I'm just thinking like, I don't. Maybe I don't want to have them like too crammed in. Kind of like so, that means behind the dome we can have all those fungal farms. And maybe also start clearing up some of our, um, like the energy and um, water production as well. Because water production, we don't need those moisture vaporators anymore, but I also don't want to get rid of them. We can just tap into that uh, extraction zone over there that has a lot of water. So yeah, once the rocket leaves, I think we're going to place this dome here. Start up some fungal farms and other stuff. 
and then um, we need also like a factory dome which could be next one down the line and research I do, complete i do want to get rid of this concrete deposit over here so it might not be a bad idea just to expand it out and start doing this here oh so much to build so much to do but unfortunately it has come uh, come to an end to this episode um uh, we'll, we'll continue with our planning, uh, well, ca very careful planning and construction in the, in the next episode. So thank you very much for joining everyone. Stay safe and uh, see you, see you again soon.